14 meters, 0.07. The motion parameters are nominal. The systems are nominal. Yuri Malenchenko uh, reporting back to the Russian flight control team in Korolyov. Everything looking very good. One more stopping point for the Jules Verne. That will come uh, moments from now when it reaches uh, 11 meters or 36 feet from the station, at which point the final go for docking will be issued uh, by the three flight control teams uh, that are working in tandem with one another. The lead flight control team for the European Space Agency in Toulouse, France, the Russian Mission Control Center in Korolyov, and the International Space Station Flight Control Team here in Houston. Ruler, yes, we are approaching 11 meters. The parameters are normal. The systems are nominal. We observe the decrease in the range rate. Copy. Now it is zero. Uh, wait for the confirmation of the ATV station keeping. And the uh, Jules Verne automated transfer vehicle is at its final station keeping point, just uh, 36 feet away, 11 meters away. This is where it was on Monday before the uh, test commands were sent by the crew to abort the approach and send uh, the ATV back into its phasing orbit for today's docking. Column station keeping at 11. Now uh, all three flight control teams are beginning their uh, conferences uh, to receive a final go for docking. Copy, copy, step 15. In work. Once uh, the uh, final go for docking is initiated, the crew can still abort the approach to within about three feet in what is called the crew hands-off point. Uh, the acronym is the CHOP point, as it is known. After that, the crew is hands-off and the uh, automated transfer vehicle is on its own. Standing by uh, for the final go for docking, the uh, European Flight Control Team in Toulouse uh, indicating that the monitoring and safety unit, the MSU as it is known, on board the Jules Verne has been enabled. This is the uh, final line of defense to ensure that the uh, Jules Verne reaches a safe automatic, automatic link up uh, with the aft docking port of the Zvezda service module inside three feet. Yuri, using uh, ATV control panel, please switch over the camera AGC mode on MC Go. Go. Ye yes. AGC mode on. European flight controllers in Toulouse, France, say they are go for docking.
Yuri, be ready to the start of the ATV final approach until the contact. All the MCCs uh, go and we'll try to be on time to give you a go. Copy, we're ready. And a final go for docking has been issued by all three flight control teams. Uh, the commands uh, to be initiated to the Jules Verne automated transfer vehicle momentarily. Commands have now been sent to reinitiate the approach of the Jules Verne. You have a go to fulfill a step 16 approach to chop and roll, uh, move the slider to the chop column. How copy? Copy. We are on approach step until the contact and remind them monitor the target to be in the within, within the dash circle after two meters it should be shifted towards the right and respectively we are waiting for your report on chop and after one meters do not issue any commands from the ATV control panel and please have the timer ready to fix the time. I'll copy. Copy all that. Now the range is about six meters. The param motion parameters are normal, 0 0.06. The rate is 0 0.06, and the systems are nominal. Copy. The automated transfer vehicle now inside six meters, approaching the crew hands-off point. The range is five meters. The parameters are normal. The systems are nominal. Three meters away, standing by for contact and capture. Parameters are normal, the system nominal. Now about two meters range. The rate is normal, parameters nominal. Copy. Report on CHOP. Pass it. No commands. The parameters are nominal. Waiting for the contact. Page 4 to step 16. 17 docking. Copy. We have a contact. Docking confirmed. And 45.39, that is for the timer. Copy. Docking confirmed at 9.45 a.m. Central Time, just south of the equator over the Atlantic Ocean. Nominal systems of the docking system. Around the world in 26 days, the European Space Agency's Jules Verne automated transfer vehicle is pulled into port at the International Space Station. The contact, dock in contact. Yes, sure. The uh, International Space Station now in free drift. The uh, forward docking probe on the Jules Verne now beginning to retract. That uh, will ultimately form a hard mate uh, between uh, the automated transfer vehicle and the aft docking port of the Zvezda service module. A textbook docking on its maiden flight of the Jules Verne.